Busting a butt with the new music there. We all know that the president likes to play golf and a whole lot of it, but that didn't stop three Westchester golf clubs from telling him, sorry, you're not getting a tee time. Now, the president reportedly was denied time at Trump National Golf Course over the Labor Day weekend. Wingfoot and Willow Ridge, two private courses, also turned down the commander-in-chief. You wrote something on this. I got to tell you, that's one of the last days that members or whatever players get to play. If the president wants to play the course, you got to basically shut it down for him. Yeah, I mean, I think it's a really cool thing that we live in a country where you can say no to the president, <laughs> but I think the club should have allowed him to play. I mean, even in, in the column that I wrote, I said, listen, this president's, he's lost his mojo to some extent. He's trying to get it back. The world is watching him. He's got international problems on three fronts. Let's give him a little bit of a break with little things like this. They should have, they should have let him play. Um, yeah, how to take the mojo the shot, yeah. <laughs> Oh, wait a second. I happen to think he's wrong. I think the president was wrong to ask, Tom. Well, I'm glad you used the term mojo. All right now we agree the president's poll numbers are not what they should be but the last time I checked this is still the president of the United States and I understand that it's the last time for golfers to get out there and play and I'm not a golfer even though my wife has been trying to get me to play for a long time but how do you tell the president of the United States no by the how way do you no say, offense, Mr. President Willow Ridge telling him no I get Wingfoot Willow Ridge you guys I, I don't care but, but, but even Richard, hurt but Richard I, I don't care which course it is how do you tell the president of the United States no you, you heard me you heard me just you people us and I, oh, what you guys, I understand. Richard is a brother. I'm the one that's used, used to you people. Yeah, but he's expanding the. But he's a brother. He's, he's a brother. brother. He's a brother. I'll take honorary on this one. Honorary. I'm telling Trump, you, Trump. There are courses in this course. Trump wouldn't let him. What do you think Trump, Trump was going to let him Trump play without the birth certificate? Use the street in front of it. Exactly. The the wing foot had been booked since 1907. I'm with. I'm with. And Willow Ridge. Yes. But mentioning Mojo, right now. Take the mojo of President Bush, the second Bush. Can you imagine a golf course saying oh, no to going, him? Going no, down, no, 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 no. You're going down the wrong road. You no, just no, no, no. I said that road mojo. Road. Yeah, based on mojo. I didn't say based on I, race. I, I, said, I didn't say based on race. Well, I didn't say based on race. Okay. I said based on mojo. <laughs> you know, four, four years ago, four years ago, they would have let him play. 2008 yeah. or 2009, right. if the president had come in, when he numbers, had his mojo, they would have let him play <laughs> right. four right. years ago. The world spinning off his axis, Bill O'Reilly having the president's back, and me telling him he's out of line <laughs> here. Say race. Dogs and cats say marrying. Race. All right. First black president wing, can't wing, play golf. I mean, gentlemen, you know, before he does another you, you people. Uh, <laughs> <gentlemen. laughs> Thankfully, that will wrap it up. We've got some headlines coming up after the break. Gentlemen.